All right, everybody, what is up? It's Thunder. Welcome back, and fellas. Today is the day, man. This is the day I've been waiting for since the first two minutes of the Modern Snorfair beta, man. COD Cold War campaign reveal with a little sliver of multiplayer thrown in there at the end. A little 10-second sliver, according to the leaks. And believe me, I will be breaking down that 10-second leak in Sony Vegas frame by frame, baby. Hopefully, it's something juicy. Hopefully, it's a juicy 10 seconds. But we already got a boatload of information about the multiplayer yesterday, if you guys saw my video. And I am pretty happy about everything that I saw there, except for the strong skill-based matchmaking. But everything else looked pretty solid. Now, according to this leaker here, Victor Z, a very reputable Chinese leaker, he said that there is a new system in multiplayer, just like last year's Modern Warfare deleted the minimap, which may cause discomfort to players. Don't ask me what the new system is. You will understand when you participate in the beta. So, oh goodness, there's a new system that's gonna make us uncomfortable? I'm pretty sure the strong skill-based matchmaking will make us feel uncomfortable enough, Victor. What could Victor be talking about, man? I mean, if you look at all the things that Modern Warfare 2019 did to make us feel uncomfortable in multiplayer, I mean, they added tons of doors and windows and safe spaces. They removed the dead silence perk, making everyone's footsteps loud. Uh, they removed the map vote. <laughs> they removed the ability to loop streaks of one life. They removed the mini map, uh, the kicking us out of lobbies after every single match. I mean, listen, man, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. These are some of the stupid, they took out the prestige system. These are some of the stupidest moves I've ever seen Call of Duty make, okay? I mean, why kick us out of a lobby after every game? That, that might be one of the dumbest things, man. Remove the minimap? I mean, what could be worse than removing the minimap? And like I said, man, I don't want to talk about this in my video yesterday because I want yesterday's video to be overwhelmingly positive because I am I wanted my first official like Black Ops Cold War kind of commentary because I did talk about a lot of stuff that's going to be a Black Ops Cold War I wanted it to be positive and there's a lot to be positive about fellas the chopper gunner and the VTOL and the napalm strike score streaks are back EKIA is back dead silence perk is back the return of the classic three lane maps 150 health but a faster time to kill sounds good to me the normal minimap is returning, no specialists, we're going to have field upgrades, swimming is back baby, auto health regen, uh, and boots on the ground gameplay with cross platform and cross gen. It all sounds lovely, but then again, Modern Warfare sounded lovely around this time last year too, didn't it people? Modern Warfare sounded lovely, so what could Victor Z be talking about man? What is this new system going to be fellas that's just like last year's deleted minimap? That kind of uncomfortable. I honestly can't think of anything worse than removing the minimap. I mean, Black Ops 4 added three major things that kind of made people feel uncomfortable. <laughs> well, definitely made people feel uncomfortable. Uh, in their game with Black Ops 4, they had the manual healing instead of the auto healing. That kind of made some people feel uncomfortable. They had the fog of war on the minimap. That made people uncomfortable. And uh, the operator mods, which if you guys have been paying attention to my videos, definitely make people feel uncomfortable. <laughs> Blade of Justice. So I guess we'll have to wait and see, but t drop it down in the comment section, fellas. What do you guys think Victor is talking about, man? What new system in multiplayer, just like last year's Modern Warfare deleted minimap, is going to cause great discomfort to us players? And why would you do this? Why would you put something in your multiplayer that you know is going to make people uh, not be comfortable? Don't you want people to have fun playing your game, Treyarch? <laughs> Can't wait to see what Victor's talking about here. But anyway, fellas, the reveal is going down today at 10 30 pacific so 1 30 if you guys are on the east coast uh, i am so hyped man it's going to be fantastic man a sequel to the original black ops game taking place between the black ops 1 and black ops 2 era come on in baby oh i cannot wait now i didn't talk about this in yesterday's video but there are going to be three versions of the game to get you could get the standard edition the cross-gen bundle, which is probably what I'm going to get because I am copping that PS5 the second it drops. And the Ultimate Edition, which is probably loaded with cosmetic crap that I really don't care about. So that cross-gen bundle look is sweet to me. I have no idea how much it's going to cost. Probably $80 or so. But all three editions include access to the beta with pre-order access to the Frank Woods Operator in Modern Warfare and Warzone. The Standard and Cross-Gen also include a Confrontation Weapons Pack. 
The standard edition is the base edition available for PS4, Xbox, Xbox One, PC. So the cross-gen edition, which is what I'm getting, cross-gen edition includes the base game, but also the current gen and next gen versions of the game. This means Activision does not plan to offer free upgrades, but rather make users buy this edition to get both versions, which will probably be offered free down the road. Players who buy the PS4 cross-gen will get the PS5 version when available. What do you mean when available? And players on Xbox One who buy cross-gen will get the Xbox Series X version when available. So what is in the Ultimate Edition? You guys might be wondering. There's also the highest edition of the game, the Ultimate Edition, which includes the cross-gen bundle and bonus content for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War via the COD Tracker. Here's what the Ultimate Edition includes. The Ultimate Edition is packed full of content and delivers the best value for fans. Yeah, sure it does. The content includes Call of Duty, Black Ops Cold War, the game. Uh, the console version include current gen version and next gen version when available. The land, sea, and air, the Navy SEAL operator pack, three operator skins, three vehicle skins, and three weapon blueprints. Ooh, weapon blueprints coming back to Black Ops uh, Cold War. Okay. I still don't know what those things are. I never used them in Modern Warfare. But the Battle Pass Bundle, Season 1 Bundle Battle Pass, plus 20 tier skips, and the Confrontation Weapons Pack. And if you pre-order the game, fellas, you get early access to the open beta, iconic operator Frank Woods, an assault rifle weapon blueprint for immediate use in Call of Duty Modern Warfare and Call of Duty Warzone. Ten tier skips for immediate use in Modern Warfare Call of Duty Warzone. All right, so there you go, fellas. So if you pre-order, you not only get the game, but you also get stuff for COD Modern Warfare 2019, if you guys even still play that. But anyway, so I'm getting the cross-gen bundle, fellas. What uh, version tickles your fancy here? What do you guys think you're getting? And uh, speaking, of, speaking of tickling some fancies, fellas... Yeah, we're holding, hold on, yeah, let's, let's get to it, oh yeah, yo, hey, you know what I'm saying, man? <laughs> anyway, fellas, <laughs> that's all I got, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this gameplay commentary, super hype for today, I cannot wait, man, COD, Cold War, Treyarch, do not let us down, remember, fellas, they were not preoccupied with Battle Royale this time around, the Battle Royale is already done, so Von Dehar and his boys, all they had to do was focus on the multiplayer, man. I'm sure it would be fantastic. From all the leaks out there, it's looking like a baby between Black Ops 4 and Black Ops 2. <laughs> Yo, that sounds good to me. I can't wait, man. Cod Cold War, come on in, baby.